talk, hands in the air, get ready for the onslaught, bounce and shake, everybody get the floor up, salute, soon let you see the Lion Bay walk up, next level everything, till we pull your card up, mommy, let me see you give it. everyone from all of us at 2k sports thanks for joining us at this most special time of the year with hall of famers grant hill and doris burke this is brian anderson joining us from the sidelines ali laforce down low here's noel the shot is good and the assist by rose and here are the knicks right side robinson it's Barrett on the wing. Into the lane. Yep, count it. Oh. Well, it's all about how do you get the best players on your team, the shots they want in the offense. Put RJ in pick and roll and let him go to work. And it's Randall with the jam. Well, known for being a terrific passer, he shows you right there. Case in point. Top it inside. Over Rose. Count it. One for one to start the game. This guy a tough cover for any defender. Creative and assertive scoring the ball. Randall right side. Fournier for three. That shot is off. The Knicks go the other way with it. First chance of the season for them to go up against this Knicks team. Randall outside. Over Rose. Six to shoot. Misses off the left iron. A little over a minute and a half into this first quarter. And he's really silencing all the haters. Randall has become a guy you can run the offense through time and time again. And it's Randall with the jam. The basket is within reach. Julius Randle understands how to finish. And the three off target. And here are the Knicks. And Randle effectively became a point center starting last year. And Coach put him in spots where he can make easy reads. So Randle knows exactly when to attack and when to look for a teammate. From and setting the tempo with an assertive move. Like, where was the defense on that play? That's a complete lack of communication on that side of the ball. These guys need to be talking to each other. Now here's Rose. Looking at his production, close to 12 points a game. Robinson with the block. This guy's nose for the basketball, and his timing as a shot blocker is intimidating. Mitchell Robinson so quick off his feet. Here's Barrett. Pass to Randall. To the inside. Out to Rose. For three. Barrett. Noel with the rebound. Back to Rose. 
handle outside. Over Rose. And it's off the back of the rim. No good. Not a lot falling for him in this quarter. He's got to stay aggressive, try to break through. See if you can get an easy opportunity. Now here's Fournier. Boy, no scoring yet from him, but that's likely to change. Well, Evan Fournier is a fundamentally sound player, and if his teammates are open, he will deliver the rock. Here's Rose. Trailing by four. We've got 113 left in the first quarter. Robinson. And it's blocked by Noel. Inside. And there's the foul. It'll go on Julius Randle. That's his That's first his foul first of the game. Foul. First team foul. 58 Second seconds left the in the first quarter of the game. Goes back up. Goes up with it again. Toppin shot is off. Well, this is the kind of shot we've come to expect him to make. He's got to be upset with that one. Pass to Walker. The three ball. And he buries his first look. How poised is Kemba Walker? This guy shooting from beyond the arc is so impressive. Here's Randall. And he gets it to go. Four for six so far. No. Man, that's now ten straight points in the paint. I'm not sure what's happened to their defense, man. Nice shot by Walker. 17 seconds left to the first quarter here. To the paint. Randall with a steal. Barrett, he's open. Pulled the shot a little left. The bounce goes his way, though. R.J. Barrett Julius trusting Randall. the jumper in the catch and shoot. Boy, if he's consistent with that, turn the lights out. And at the end of one, a closely contested game so far. And if you're just joining us, it's been a pretty even game through the first quarter. All right, before we move on, what do you guys think about what we've seen from the Knicks? They're getting a big contribution from the bench already. As a coach, I think you get a certain feel for what your team needs. And credit this guy for not waiting around. He went ahead and made the adjustment. Walker for three. And it won't go. His first miss. He's two of three now. Obviously, you love Kemba Walker's ability to score the basketball. But it's his exuberance, his spirit that breathes life into any team he plays on. To the middle. Here's Toppin. Got a hand on it. Boy, Gibson so good at timing these rejections. Twice on the pipes from Taj. And talk about imposing your will. That's 10 straight points in the paint. And coming off the knee injury a year ago, there were times he looked better than ever. Doris, I don't know if I've ever seen him happen. Yeah, I mean, listen, he got the stem cell injection. He stayed patient with his rehab. You feel great for this guy because he is a team first person, Kemba Walker. Quickly. And that's good. His first bucket of the game. Well, we've known for a long time Kemba Walker is gifted on the offensive end, and it's not just about his scoring. Look at that on the assist. And here we go, the Knicks in transition. And here's New York now. Toppin goes in. And he got the whistle on the way up. So he'll be headed to the line for a pair. That's his first person. Looking at the modern game, Grant, what adjustments would you have to make in your game to thrive in the league today? Well, I would have worked more on developing the three-point shot. Back in the 90s, it was more about the mid-range game, uh, a la Michael Jordan. But these guys now, they live at the arc, and that's just not how we did it back in the day when I was playing. Expanding his range every season, you see how confident Kemba Walker is. It doesn't matter the distance. And the Knicks miss again. Well, defenses are content to give up the mid-range, right? It's not the high percentage restricted area or the three. You can see they're prepared to give up that shot. 
<laughs> and plays like that one can make the difference in a close game. And it definitely got the bench on their feet, too. Well, credit him for going for it, not settling, saying, I'm going to attack. Here's Knox. Well, he hasn't scored yet, but I'm sure that'll change. And denied. He sends it right off the glass. And it's going to be out of bounds. The Knicks will retain possession. So both teams changing it up here. Just five on the clock. It's rebounded by New York. Next up, they'll face the Timberwolves in Minnesota. Shot is blocked. Out of bounds. It'll be New York's ball. Substitution on the court. Here's Rose. Two shots, two makes. Off to a good start. They're finding ways to get the ball into the paint. Five consecutive buckets. Pass to Gibson. Ooh, plenty of contact on that shot. Officials call the foul, and he'll take two free throws now. Let's remember, Taj Gibson is one of the most physical players in the league on both ends. He loves to pick up these fouls. At the line. So one for two that time at the strike. And they seem to have taken a more heads-on approach this quarter. <laughs> and it's two getting them to the free throw line. Two minutes. Shots no good by Noel. Noel's got his first points of the night. How about that show of strength from Nerland's Noel? No fear in how he attacks the defense on these shots. Outside Burks. Back to Noel. Out left to the wing. The three, Barrett. It's rebounded by Barrett. The Knicks with the lead. Driving inside. Here's Fournier. He's off on that one. New York goes the other way with it. Let's remember, this guy is a five-star recruit when he played two seasons at Kentucky. Emmanuel quickly improved tremendously his sophomore year and then got drafted late first round back in 2020. Pass to Noel. And he sinks that one, hitting the back of the rim on the way in. Noel's got four points in the quarter. Well, Nerland's Noel adding to his offensive repertoire. Soft-looking jumper from the big man. That's three buckets in a row off assist. Now the Knicks with it. Trailing by two. To the paint. Here's Noel. Excellent D there from Noel. Never easy to stop this guy at the rim, but that is a beautiful contest right there. This energy is unmatched. The finish and transition, nice and easy. Back to Noel. Outside Burks. There's 18 seconds left to play in the second quarter. Pass to Barrett. New York needs to get one up quick. The timer ticks. Rose outside. Oh, and he just knocked down the buzzer beater. Yeah, that's exactly how to end the half on a high note. Tacking three points onto this lead at the horn. The mood in each of those locker rooms will be very different. And we hope you've enjoyed the broadcast thus far. We're halfway through the game. Here's Toppin. Oh, and there's the whistle on the shot. So two free throws for him coming up. That's his first personal. They'll pin that one on Julius Randle. At the line for New York. The first one falls. At the line, two shots. He's perfect from the line this time. Here's Rose. With the drive. Oh, he's locked in. Drains his fifth shot in his many attempts. And now, almost all their points coming from the paint. New York trailing. Now here's Walker. Pass to Randall. Fournier with the ball. And he'll draw the foul. He'll head to the line for two. It's going to go on Nerland's Noel. You get a little glimpse into the mindset of Evan Fournier. This guy will do whatever it takes to win. 
And the Knicks with the possession here. Here's Rose. And Toppin pulls it down. Now the Knicks with it. It's a five-point game. Next up, they'll face the Timberwolves in Minnesota. Well, you can't fall asleep on R.J. Barrett. Got the size, got the ups. Go ahead. Easy work right there, R.J. Noel, no good. And it's the Knicks with the ball. Pass to Fournier. Out of bounds. And it's out of bounds. They say it was last touch by Noel. Substitution. He had the right idea, just couldn't come up with the swipe. Yeah, the anticipation was there. The hustle was there. Very close to picking that one. Here's Toppin. Six points for him. Barrett up top. Outside Walker. Oh, can't tie it up as that one misses. Pass to Noel. piece of it and it's stolen by Noel left side Barrett on the take oh, yes great gee. play by Walker to set it up Barrett's got his Walker. first two points their interior D continues to look shaky not a good matchup for them right now outside Fournier from deep is rebounded by Barrett all right, time now to pick it up. You're one for four, and you certainly don't want to give your opponent momentum. And a lot's changed for Kimball Walker. Bought out over the summer, and of course, this was after he was sent out to Oklahoma City with the Thunder. Now, Kimball gave up some cash in that buyout, but he feels like he's in a great fit with the Knicks to help them make another run. Now a timeout called by New York. One thing you know when defending Barrett, he wants to get to the rim every oh, chance he can. That was your Knicks City answer. Make some noise. Pass to Robinson. Outside Walker. No one near him. That one a tad offline, but it drops in for him. Walker's got eight points. You know, Grant, on his attacks to the basket, Barrett is looking for points, a foul, or both. Oftentimes, initiating the contact, too. As he gets more established in the league, he'll get more calls to go his way. Here's Robinson. The quick look, no good that time. Boy, against so little defensive pressure, you have to convert that. And they've done well from the free throw line this half. No misses yet. First team foul. Free throw good, Walker. At the line, 40. And when you talk to folks around the league, no one has a bad word to say about Walker. He's just a good guy, a loyal guy. And of course, Kimba's won the NBA Sportsmanship Award multiple times. Yeah, he's such a glue guy. I mean, he brings people together. He's a guy who improves the culture of your team. Now here's Barrett. Mitchell Robinson, when he contests shots, he is flat intimidating. He changes what you're thinking as an offensive player. Boy, absolutely no rim protection, leading to a lot of easy buckets here. Trying to find a spark here. Yes, indeed. A rough stretch offensively. They could really use a basket. New York foul. And there's the Kimball foul. Walker. It'll go on Kimball Walker. That's his second person. That's foul number two for him. Second team foul. New York with the ball. They're on a 10-2 run here. Three Drops in the three. Goal. He's got 10. That is a tough shot, folks. On the move, the pull-up jumper, but Kemba Walker making easy work of it. Driving in. Kicks it out to Barrett. Here's the three. Knocks down the long K. Barrett's got nine. Well, you have to understand, spacing is provided when you can make threes. R.J. Barrett delivers. Top it inside. Shoots over Randall. Oh, A nice shot by Toppin. And the Knicks lead by 13. And they've really managed to dominate inside. 
Walker with it. And Walker picks him up defensively. On the wing quickly. On the wing quickly. Off target from outside. Now eight seconds separating the two clocks. To the inside. Pass to Robinson. Here's Walker. Here's Knox. And it's good as he snugs it right through the net. Well, this is what we expect. The rise and fire from Kevin Knox in a catch-and-shoot situation. Better guard him now. Mitchell Robinson. That's he misses the free throw. So it's both teams making substitutions here. At the line. And no luck at the stripe this time. Second one won't fall. Inside. Pass to Toppin. From deep three-point range. It's rebounded by New York. With one on the clock. And there's the rejection. And so it's the New York Knicks. And as we head into the fourth, we'll see if there's a comeback in the works. Or if it's more of the same for the first three quarters. Here's Rose. Another basket. He's now six for seven in the contest. Another one for Derrick Rose. This is a flashback to when he used to do this on a nightly basis. Pass to Gibson. Fournier for three. Connects from downtown. You simply must play better defense than that. This guy is too good from distance. And it's the Knicks with the ball. They've led by as many as 14. Down low. And here's Randall. Nails it. He's now six for eight from the floor. No. And guys, the way this defense is getting manhandled down low, you have to wonder if they're at 100% right now. Pass to Toppin. Back to quickly. To the paint. All alone. Boy, clanks that one off the back iron and it falls. And Gibson always has had a solid mid-range game. You can't let him get comfortable from that spot. And it's stolen by Noel. Outside Barrett. This one for three. Quickly with a rebound. Here's Toppin. Pass to Quickly. Shot clock at six. Here's Gibson. And with that one, the deficit trimmed to single digits. We know this. Taj Gibson loves getting physical. Doesn't matter how aggressive you are. Now Barrett sinks the tray. Whoa, that man is laser focused. Now, that's bad defense for a team that has a long way to go to catch up. Well, credit the offense, though. If you're going to come with casual defensive effort, this team's responsibility is to take advantage, and they do. Well, he's such a good athlete for a center. It's how he's able to succeed despite being one of the smallest fives in the NBA. To the inside. And he takes it in for the layup off a very nice feed. And a look at how the hustle game has been going for New York. Their activity at the defensive end has been impressive. Attacking and coming away with steals. They've gotten out on the break over and over tonight as well. A lot of baskets coming in transition. Shots no good by Noel. How about that show of strength from Nerland's Noel? No fear in how he attacks the defense on these shots. Well, he's a quality mid-range shooter, but he can't get that one to go. Out of bounds. Knicks ball as New York keeps possession. The Knicks making a switch here. Pass to Randall. Back to Rose. To the middle. Randall can't hit. The Knicks with the lead. Rose with it. Randall's in his pocket. That's his first personal. First team. A look at the clock. A little under three and a half minutes gone by in the fourth. Inside. 
Randall. And it's Randall with the jam. That's two things right there for R.J. Barrett. It's awareness and unselfishness. Pretty pass. Fournier for three. Gets the three to fall. Kevin Fournier. More than capable of knocking down that shot. He's not shy. Back to Rose. Shoots. Fournier with a rebound. To the paint. Here's Gibson. And that one is hammered home. Yeah, Julius Randle has a good feel on the offensive end. On time and on target with the pass. Rose with it. Here's Noel. And Noel hammers it down. Looking to close things out. That might have been the nail in the coffin. Well, at this point, they're so far up, it would take a real collapse to give this game away at this point. Now a timeout called by New York. They're behind by eight. There's 45 seconds left in the fourth quarter. Now into the lineup for your New York Knicks. Mitchell Robinson. There's 45 seconds left to play in the fourth quarter. And here is Barrett. Rose with it. Picked up by Rose. Over Rose. To the middle. Randall. Good. And the Knicks lead by 10. From Maryland, Finishing the game strong. This is how you shut the door on any hopes of a comeback. No question. They've gotten hot at exactly the right time. Clutch play on a team level. Pass to Randall. Shots no good by Noel. And they came in here with some attitude, and they brought out their best play. And I couldn't agree more. What makes it that much more impressive, they're doing it on the road. From deep, Rose. Can't get it to fall. And so New York takes this one by a big margin. They have to feel good about this.